Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location, you are tuned in to this UAG disbursement update. It's quite not a palatable story. I stumbled on this uh, VN. I decided to kind of uh, share it with you guys. It's very, it's very disheartening. When I listened to it, I, I was not happy. I said, is this what human being does to human being? You know, I want to leave you to draw your own conclusion. I don't want to draw a conclusion for you. So just listen to the VN and we'll see at the end of the VN. Please, guys, subscribe to our channel. Let's pray. You know, it's, it's Easter and uh, we are fasting. Uh, today is Friday. Today is a good Friday. And um, uh, the Muslim also are in their Ramadan period. So this is a holy time. This is a holy time. So let's just pray that God may touch because this grant now is not in heavens. is with humans. Now, it's human powers now that are stopping this grant and the human manipulation so let's pray if you're a christian pray if you're a muslim pray this is a holy time let this boss happen let this boss happen listen to this vn and drop your comment we'll see you at the end of the vn Anga, thank you very much sir god bless you sir for this for these explanations i am a christian and uh, i am an Igbo man too but if I see a post again around my area, I will raise an arm and I will gather people to stop me. I am saying so. I am saying so. And anybody who is supporting a post again in this grand saga, that person is not sincere, even to his own spirit. I have myself attracted so many enemies because of the way a post again has been running this thing. From inception, from the time we started hearing Apostle Ken and the UAAG, he has not been straightforward. If I can give an example as this other game, you remember when they were saying uh, um, uh, Theophilus was dragging, nobody can take my mandate. That. At a point, Theophilus challenged if you know. The mandate is with you. Come out and let me see you. People waited for Apostle Ken. Say something. Let us know where we were going. Apostle Ken remained silent. They were doing ooh, ooh, ooh. from the beginning. Apostle Ken has been doing ooh, 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 up till this very moment. He has never come straight anytime. He has never come straight anytime. Anytime. So, whoever that is de defending him is just lying to his own skin. His own, he is lying even to his own, to God Almighty. He is not a straightforward person. And the, in this grand community, he has not been, nothing good about him I can say. I can say nothing. I remember when uh, that our, our brother, that military guy that used to talk that time before he joined the think tank we no longer hear his voice again because he has joined the think tank if not at least he used to talk some time i remember when he, he he spoke to ken publicly with voice notes saying that the transitionity of ken is too much that the way he he runs things is not good that his transitionity, his secrecy is too much and it is not good. And for goodness sake, since all this secrecy in grand community, what has he done? Whoever that is saying that he did not collect money, come to this app issue. I remember everything Ken said about that app issue. All lies. He has never said anything that happened to the way he said it. I remember when he said that the app will be launched in so, so, so time. Was the app launched in today? No. Later, he said that the people should contribute money. That the app broke down. And the people contributed. At the end of the day, he said he have not collected any money. 
even the money Nguaga to be collected on his behalf. Up to this very moment, Nguaga Atuku is still explaining, swearing on top of it that he gave a post to Ken up to 40 million naira he collected. Up to 40 million naira that every money he collected he gave it to a post to Ken. I remember when other uh, uh, man, um, um, that Yoruba man, I have forgotten his name, when he came up with the issue of money, this, that. What did Ken say? So, Ken has never been straightforward. All this why we have been hearing uh, uh, Ken is demanded, Ken is demanded. At the end of the day, it means that his name was not even there. Kenny did not have money in his NGO's account already. He went to when uh, uh, the memorial of Mama uh, Rita Pitru Sodut was organized. Ken openly said, The money is already shared. Money you have not seen, they already shared. He came back again during verification. I said it even in the media that before the last set will finish verification, the first set will be getting an alert. After the verification again, he put Thanksgiving, lying with the name of the Most High God, and you call that person a good Christian and somebody I should follow. Eh? People question though, oh this Thanksgiving, it has been a, it, it has been the other in the grand community that after this Thanksgiving, nothing will happen again. No. Ken said no. That all that failed doesn't mean that his own will fail. And the, after the Thanksgiving and everything, everywhere remained silent. That month passed. The next thing we heard is that enemies we are writing petition. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. December gone, that, that month gone, we enter December, he began to lie again. He began to lie again, that even in December, remain one month. Somebody who said that he has submitted the, the what did he call it, the payment schedule in the bank, that they were at the verge of this buzzing and something came up. By January ending, he told us that the money has not dropped. And you want me to follow that man? See, look at what Bode David, up to this very moment, Bode David, a pastor, a Christian, is still telling us that um, Theophilus still has money. And Bode David has not opened his mouth to condemn Theophilus, uh, uh, the woman who calls herself Mama Supreme, in all the evil they did. Even Bode David that was uh, uh, telling people, hey, gather, let us know how we we'll do this. At a point, Bode David decided to sit on the fence, claiming a good boy. I'm not fighting any grand handle. And you want me to follow such person because he's a Christian, hypocrite, people who do eye service. Huh? Even, even, even among all the prayer group, among all the members of the prayer group, Yorubas are there, Igbos are there, Northerners are there. Among all of them, I choose only Ustaz Dawu. Even German machine is not straightforward. Let me talk. Because he has been acting what I don't know. It's only Ustaz Dawu that will come out and tell you the blunt truth to how it is. At least, even if he is not 100% honest, he is at least 85% honest. The one you call Pastor Felix Am Am Amupita, has he come out to say something? You cannot hear him say anything, even to tell you where are we or where we are going. He cannot, and he is proud about it. And yet, you want me to follow such person because he is a Christian. All of them who are Christians, even, they don't know, they don't want to know the pains they are causing people by toying with, with their emotions. People are dying here and there, and you don't want to know. Huh? You want me to follow such person because he is a Christian. You want me to defend him. If I should defend Ken, somebody should tell me one single thing Ken said that 
happen to the way he said it. I remember when Movement for the Masses asked him in sometime June, oh God, if you know that this thing will not happen so so and so so time, don't promise us. We promised them that it will not exceed that June. And that June passed. July passed, August passed, nothing happened. You remember when he told us to give him 73 hours? What did happen? Somebody, a serial liar, a serial liar, a heartless liar, will continue to lie and you want me to support him because he is a Christian. Turn the fire his Christianity. I will regard, I even regard a prostitute more than a liar. I regard a prostitute more than a liar. A liar is more dangerous than anything. If you don't know, know it. A liar is more dangerous. That's why the Bible said that devil is a liar and the father of all liars. If you don't know, know it. A liar is more dangerous than anything. A liar, liar is, is dangerous than a prostitute. If you don't know, know. After all, you, you don't have anything. Prostitute is all about give me, I give you. You go, I go. Pay me, I, I rob your back. You go, I go. But a liar can put you into trouble. By their lies, they have made us liars too. So forget all these sentiments. All of us, they are living in Abuja. I heard when Obi uh, 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 um, was telling him about the school fees of his children. And he told me, don't worry, I have heard. Has Obi asked me how I am faring over here? They are in Abuja enjoying lives. They don't know how we are faring. Some of, many of us are dying. Many of us are suffering. The worst is that we are being taunted in the street because of the lies, the lies they have told us and we told people we are being seen as liars. Yeah, yeah. Even if they even if they pay each beneficiary 10 million, it cannot wipe the shame we have received because of this thing. Nonsense. Supporting who? Get out of the war now. So guys, you have listened to it. You know, I don't want to kind of take sides or draw conclusion, but it's good for if a good man keeps quiet in the midst of evil, it's like condoling the evil. What Ken has done is not good. It's not good. I'm going to look for the video where he said that he has not collected money from anybody. I'm going to still show you guys. You know, it's quite pathetic. But let's pray. Let's be hopeful. The last thing we lose in life is hope. And once there is life, there is hope. We pray that next month, we pray that there will be this movement. See you on the other side, guys. Happy Easter in our advance. You know, happy fasting. And also, Baal Kadisala also in advance. See you on the other end.